Hey everyone, I'm making a short video update and review on the cinnamon donut e-liquid recipe from yesterday. I have been vaping it too much and I'm used to the cinnamon taste, but if you're trying it for the first time, you might find it too strong or too concentrated. So I revised the original recipe together with a double shot version. Here I will show you the new recipe first and the original one right after. Now the ratios are a bit lower as you can see and I also added the much needed smooth from TFA in this recipe. If you don't have smooth, you can also use any alternative to triacetine that you have in your collection now. In the double shot version, I also raised the vegetable glycerin to 70% so it can smoothen out the taste and reduce the intensity of the propylene glycol flavorings. I will do a review on both the original and the new version right now very quickly for you. I will use the same mod for both at 25 watts with a 0.6 ohm coil. First I will vape the new recipe so I can compare it better with the original. Okay yeah so this one is more smooth definitely. You can still taste the cinnamon but it doesn't stick in your mouth after for too long like with the first mix. The vanilla in here pops out much more I can say and that is probably because of the smooth used. The sugar cookie also here helps the cinnamon more now that is at a lower ratio. Okay so now I will clean the mod and vape it for 10 minutes with the old recipe in it so the new coil can get soaked with a different e-liquid and then I will vape it and tell you what I think right after. Alright so the second one I like it but I'm, I'm not the perfect person to say this because I, I'm really used to this recipe and I'll, I would liked it from before anyways. But I can definitely see the sharpness. If you're vaping it for the first time the cinnamon will really stand out to you. But if you like cinnamon e-liquid give it some time and maybe experiment with the ratios and it will definitely grow on you too. What is good with the original recipe the one that I made on the first video is that it can take nicotine very very well. I can see this going all the way up to 25 or maybe 30 milligrams and still taste the same. Now I wouldn't recommend to everyone to go that high with the nicotine but if you've tried it and you're used to it this is one of the e-liquids that you can put a lot of concentration and it will still taste pretty sweet. Okay so that is all for this update. I will post all the links for the new recipe in the description. So now leave your comments and thoughts about this recipe and I will see you again on the next video.